Hey, thank you for joining my channel again. It is November 3rd in Ontario, Canada, and it's like 13 degrees out, which is like 54 degrees. So I'm off. It's Friday. I'm taking full advantage. I'm at Christie Lake. I've only ridden here once this season, believe it or not, and I bought the pass, which is expensive. Anyways, I'm going to ride these trails today. There's only like one other person here I see. So I'm going to go out there and let's go ride together and let's see how nice it is. And I got a feeling the trails are in good condition. So let's go ride. I got my flannel shirt on. Let's go. Let's go do this together. Thanks for watching. All right, let's hit up this trail. It is so nice out. It's so warm. It's crazy how nice it is out. This is November. <laughs> November 3rd. I am not at work today, so this is all good. I might not even get hot. I'm wearing pants for the first time. I think like ever in the trails. I thought it'd be colder. Even wearing a flannel shirt. It's all those videos I've been watching of like Arizona and Utah lately where all the guys there riding pants and like flannels. So I think subliminally that's where I want to be. I really want to do a mountain bike ride again out in Utah and probably hit like Arizona up. It's so beautiful out there. The trails are amazing. <clears throat> I'm still talking about that Zen trail because, oh, that was a nice gigantic stick. Anyways, I'm still talking about Zen trails just for the fact that I uh, did lousy. That was my first trail ride of the season and I just sucked. It's pretty windy out though, I can, it's not as bad in the bush, but there's definitely wind. Ooh, look at the mud too. It's been raining a little bit, it even snowed, ow. Even snowed a bit on uh, Halloween, which was crazy. Hasn't snowed on Halloween since I was a kid. So I took my kids out trick or treating, and uh, it snowed for about half the time we're out. Crazy. All right. So uh, my season's almost over. I mean, it's not snowing yet and it's November, so I'm hoping I can get a couple of rides in, but we're getting, we're getting near the end. I'm, I'm feeling it. And this bike has been awesome. My first carbon bike, my first expensive bike, and uh, loving it. I think ride's amazing. No issues at all, except for my seat post cr making cranky noises. I think it's my seat post. I'll have to, I'll have to take it over, let Brian the Dixon cycle, check it out for me. Huh. I feel bad. I couldn't, <laughs> couldn't buy a Marin from him. That's he's a Marin dealer, but. Uh, Hey, I had a whole video while I was researching what to buy and all that kind of stuff. What I was looking for. And the Marins just didn't have it. Although I just saw their newest edition the other day. And it, uh, I think it's a Rivstone XR or something. It's freaking sick. Aluminum. But just fucking sick. Anyway. Brian's a great guy. Shop's great. Just a local guy in my town. And we have the same last name, so gotta support him. Come on. <laughs> Actually, I was just in there the other day. Funny story. I was out riding Turkey Point and uh, did what I, I shouldn't do. I seem to do it all the time, which is change gears going up a climb. I think I would have learned from last season where I 
bent a tooth on my cassette and broke a chain. But no, no, I did not. <laughs> I did the exact same thing. You know, put the clip here. Oh, oh boy. Oh, I was not ready for this. Oh boy. Should not have geared down for that. Oh boy. Shit. And uh, did the same thing. Bent another tooth on the cassette. Brian sorted it out for me. It's my first time riding it since. And I don't hear or feel the craziness. So, as usual, I think uh, Dr. Dixon over at <laughs> Dixon Cycle fixed my ailments on my bike. I hope. We'll see. But there's a shout out to my buddy Brian. This cool little shop where I live. Oh man, what a beautiful day out. Like I said, I saw one other person in the parking lot. Well, I didn't see the person, I just saw his truck. So, someone else had my train of thought, get their bike and get out. It's super nice having Friday off though. A little bit of mold. There's some mud. A little bit of mud there. Not too bad though. Considering it has been raining and even snowing a bit in the past week. I think one. This is Trillium, I believe. You can barely see it. But, I'm on it. Squirrels are out in force. Look at that. The promo, what I was just saying. Pardon me. I feel pretty good though. So much leaves. But at least it's not snow, so that's always, that's always good. All right, on the Julian Trail still. It does feel weird wearing pants though, that's for sure. Oh, this bike is feeling great. Yeah, all Brian did was just hammer the one tooth out. So it's straight. That feels fucking great. Just gotta fix that. I think it's the C post again, like my other bike. Yeah, I feel it. Gotta feel. We'll fix that up during the winter season, I think. But the bike is performing awesome. All right, let's hit up Happy Hawthorne. Oh, a little, little thing there, all mud. Super great weather out. Take the high road up here. All right, 
very very nice hill climb so many leaves Oh yeah. Oh, off the trail a little bit there. Whoa, it's a fast squirrel. Oh, a little more mud. Oh, trying to get around that. All right. Okay. Good old hill climbs. So nice out today. Oh, it's so nice to get on the trails again. It's been a couple of weeks. And a leaf. Yeah, it's been about I think about three weeks because the weather's just been shite. Now it's finally dry out. I don't really mind the cold. It's just the wet. So it gets like really muddy. It's like not even just slick, it gets like, like a mud hole. You're just sliding out everywhere. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. Pine cones everywhere. Oh boy. Nice. We'll get back. A happy Hawthorne, but let's go hit up this nice blue over here. Could have sworn it used to be a black, but maybe it got downgraded, I'm not sure. All right, cut the mustard. All right, let's talk, do a nice older gentleman on almost the identical bike to mine, but a couple thousand dollars more because it has the motor. <laughs> it's the E1, the EX year. Whatever, all I know is it's like $9,000. My wife would kill me. So uh, no, mine does not have the motor. <clears throat> Pardon me. But like I was saying, like, I'm sure one day I will get an e-bike when I'm a little bit older. I still want to ride, just like that gentleman. But I can still pedal, so I want to keep pedaling for as long as I can. Keep myself in shape, you know. Come 
all these leaves. Crazy. Tons of leaves. And once that wind hits, it's a bit colder. I think I'm also like in the shade a bit now. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I think, uh, I think that clicking and jumping from my drivetrain is gone. That's awesome. Didn't have to buy a new cassette like last year. Nice. So nice out. <sighs> Love being in the woods. <sighs> All right. Over the roots we go. Straight uphill in a second. So I cross the road. All right, I'm ready. This guy's house is awesome. Just backs on to like a little trail system. But I uh, sick. Got the leaves on there again. There we go. Oh yeah. Nice. That was fun. I really like cut the mustard. It's fun. Cut the mustard. All right, let's let us jump back on Happy Hawthorne.
Man, this is a great weather. I'm actually warm in the old flannel and pants. And you know what? Surprisingly, not as uncomfortable as I thought it would be. Just so used to wearing shorts. back on Trillium. It's pretty dry in most of these sections. Not bad at all. I guess a lot of leaves, but that's about it. Quiet. Love it. Just love it. I can't believe it's after Halloween. I'm still riding. Crazy. There's no snow on the ground. It's awesome. <clears throat> Alright. This is my only gripe. I pay every year, so I'm allowed to gripe. If we get rid of these ridiculous hoop to hoop things, because like it's flat, so you can't really jump. It just gets in the way of a nice speedy descent. So please, Christy Lake Mountain Bike guys, I'll even come in, send me a PM or a DM, and I will come in and help you guys with my own shovel. Take those out. <laughs> Besides, that, everything's great. Doing a hell of a job, guys and girls. All right, continuing on the Trillium Trail. Oh, pedal strike as soon as I get in. This is the spot that I always say watch out for cut down trees. For whatever reason, they put them the same height as your pedals. <clears throat> so there'll be little stumps on the side of this trail. If you're not watching like right now, you will hit with your pedals 100%. One hundred percent. Somebody told my buddy that oh, head strike. <laughs> told my buddy that was listening. Heard him behind me just bail. He hit it way too hard with his pedal. Came right off the bike. <laughs> the only thing I really bitch about this bike ooh, is uh, the pedals, like that bottom bracket. So low. It's just so low. It's the part that sucks. Oh. 
Alright. Alright, let's go up. Alright, EBB and flow. See now enter. Alright, here we go. <clears throat> Squished around a little bit. Thick. More pine needles in here than uh, leaves. Oh yeah. Oh, can't do that burn. Got a tree over it. That wind is picking up good. Oh, blue jays. Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Hard to see all these pine needles are. Whew. Ah. So pretty in here. Rise and shine. All right. Oh, a little more mud. Rise and shine. Oh, that's gonna be tweet. Oh yeah. It's so nice out. Ah, everything except for that squeaky sound. Which is probably my seat post. So fun. It's funny, man. Whenever I go mountain biking, there's hardly anybody out riding. I know there's lots of mountain bikers. Just never ride when I'm riding. Not complaining. I'm sure if I was on the Don right now, although I've never been in the Don Valley, I bet you that place is packed right now. Friday. 
November. It is warm out. I gotta hit that place up. I haven't gone there yet. Hit me up in the comments and tell me where I should park and where I should, what trails I should hit up because I've never been there, so I'm not sure where to go when it comes to that. Oh, came through the trail. Oh man. Mm -mm. Pull up ground is a little soft there. Little brake check and my tire slid up just a tad. Just a little bit. Oh yeah. Never coming backward. I mean, yeah, it's like backwards. I usually take it the other way. I mean, they switched it up this year. It's way more fun the other way. It's faster. You're all downhill. All right, sweet. Rise and shine. Ooh, that was fun. All right. All right, we're gonna hit up Runaway. It is blue. Crazy, nobody in here. Like it's so nice out. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Run away. Whew. A little more mud. I'll stay out of the way of that. Oh. Okay. The flow goes that way. So I can finish it off. I'll go up this way and come down. Cool. Cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool,
Oye. Shit, I'm the wrong way. Oh, yeah. That was fun. Although I did not go the way I wanted to go. I gotta learn how to jump off stuff better. That's my whole problem. Where am I going? I hate when you get tired. Start slowing down. Alright. I'm not sure what I just hit up. I think I'm still run away. Sun's going down a bit. It's a little colder. But it's nice. Because I'm hot. This will finish up the day. I either inhaled a bug or like a leaf or something blowing in the wind.
Oh, here comes the heavy breathing. Well, believe it or not, fuck, I feel pretty decent. Since I haven't ridden for like three weeks. I feel pretty good. Too bad the end of the season's coming. I just started to get back in shape at the end. Oh, noise. These leaves, crazy. Okay, well, that was a fun ride. I'm loving it. Christy Lake, always a fun ride out here. I'm not sure what time it is, it must be. I got here around like 1.30, 2 o'clock maybe, something like that. Must be around 4 o'clock. I'm not sure. Definitely a little bit chillier. Sun's going down, I think. Not quite as sunny out. Ooh. Oh boy. Ooh. If I'm gonna do it, I just don't crank on it when I change gears. Cranks and pedal just hit roots, rocks all day long. <sighs> Looks like I'm almost out. Here we go. E B B and flow. Whew. Well, that was a fun trail ride on a November 3rd. That's insane. I don't think I've ever ridden in November before. Well, thank you so much for watching my channel. I would love it if you'd subscribe. I'm like over 500 subscribers now. I think the last time I looked, I was at like 515 or 520 or something. That's freaking awesome. So please give me a like. Give me a like. <laughs> please subscribe because that would be awesome. And please comment. Comment, tell what you think. Are they as horrible as I say they are, these trail rides? 
my video, my editing. <laughs> Anyways, thanks so much for coming out with me on a November day. Oh look, a white swan. Jesus, crazy. Anyways, thanks so much for, for coming out riding with me. We'll see you again, maybe before the new year. Maybe we'll get another ride in. Take care.